My name is Lynn Rogers. I am a research scientist at the Shirley Ryan Ability Lab. I'm the director of the Neuroplasticity Laboratory. I'm a member of the Center for Brain Stimulation and a member of the Neuromechanics Laboratory. The goal for this study is to show that the combination of brain stimulation and targeted task-specific occupational therapy is both safe and effective for rehabilitation following stroke. When you've had a stroke, you've got one area of the brain that's been damaged by the stroke. You've got the other side of the brain that's healthy and may actually be over-contributing to the problem that's going on. So we're using stimulation to try to create a balance between those two hemispheres of the brain so that they're most able and most receptive to work with our therapists and work with um, the occupational therapy that we're doing that we know can promote change. So the target for this study are individuals that have had a stroke. They've had a stroke to one hemisphere of their brain, and they're experiencing problems with wrist, hand, arm function, things on that level. So you're going to be involved in this study over the course of six months of time. For six weeks of that, we're going to be doing intensive therapy three days a week. You get 15 minutes of brain stimulation and then an hour of intensive one-on-one -on -one occupational therapy. And so the benefit to the individual is highly intensive occupational therapy, therapy that's task-oriented, very specific, that we know has a neuroscience, neurological basis for creating recovery. And then so that we have a better understanding of how well this therapy is working for you, we would have you come back in at one month, at three months, at six months after we finished therapy to say, not only were you able to get better, but were you able to maintain those improvements?